Okay, this video is going to go through um, how to equalise um, a melee. Um, so if you go to the top of a, a trad pitch, um, we've got three points of contact. The number of points of contact will really depend upon uh, the quality of the placements if this is a, a, a trad route. Um, quite often we aim for three, but um, that would be covered in a different video about how you evaluate these placements. So all I'm going to do is put my screw gates into each of the three anchor points. Grab a spare screw gate from the back of my harness. And I'm going to put this into the bottom part, the lower part of um, the rope loop here. Um, it's a personal choice. I prefer to have the belay plate on the top part of the rope here. With this end of the rope, I'm then going to put a clove hitch into that carabiner. And I'll leave it open actually. And then to adjust the clove hitch, I'm going to take the middle of the knot here. Pull it, you can see I'm going to get closer and more snug onto that first screw gate, which is here. It should be nice and tight. Then, with the end of the rope here, go back to the next screw gate, do that one up, and then it's just repeat the process clip, clove hitch. Okay, and then Pull that nice and tight. Okay, so now I've got two points. And you would just repeat the process um, for the third point. But you can see that my screw gate here is getting quite full with clove hitches. So I might just have to use uh, an extra screw gate. There is an alternative. So in with my other screw gate, up to the third point of contact. Again, tension that one off. And now I just need to check all of them that they're all under tension. So you can see you've got a little bit of play in that one. These two are quite tight, so again I can just work out which one that is. Just get some tension into that one, so that's nice and tight, which has made that one loose. So just repeat the process there. So now I've got three equalized and independent anchor points. And when you think about independence, if I was to take a pair of scissors and cut that strand, because everything is isolated with clove hitches, um, the rest of the system won't fail. Um, so then, I can shout down to my B-layer safe. That might take me off b -lay. just pull up the rest of the rope, grab my B-lay plate, As I said before, I'm going to put this on the top part of my uh, rope loop. And again, personal choice, but for later on in videos, I like the back bar on that carabiner to be on the top. Okay, and then we're all set up. 